Hello everyone, this is David from Automotive Press. It's only about a month away, I think, before we get to see the 2022 Tundra in full glory. But uh, in the meantime, there continues to be some speculation about the powertrain and the rest of the Tundra. Uh, now, I talked about the fact that V8 engine is not coming back for 2022 Tundra in one of my previous videos, and that brought up a lot of comments and some anger even, because people love the V8 engine, especially the Toyota V8 engine. So people are either upset or sad about the fact that V8 engine isn't coming back. But recently there has also been speculation about the diesel engine and whether diesel will show up in the Tundra. And the reason why is that uh, Toyota USA uh, uploaded a number of weeks ago a video about uh, Engine 101, how does engine work? And the uh, first video they put up is diesel engine, how does diesel engine work? And what a strange place and timing to show that in the YouTube video. So a lot of speculation began to pop up and saying that maybe Toyota is prepping us slowly for a possibility of a diesel engine or diesel hybrid showing up in a Tundra for the model year 2022. And it's a reasonable assumption to make because uh, it seems strange, right, that Toyota would uh, suddenly talk about diesel engine when it has not offered diesel engine in any of its lineup. But unfortunately, this is one of those rumors that I have to shoot down because from my research and investigation, I can tell you that there will be no diesel engine in the 2022 Toyota Tundra. Now, full disclosure, maybe a few years down the road, it's possible that either diesel or even V8 engine could come back based on feedback from consumers. But everything that I know about Toyota's strategy, its business uh, methods, and its approach to future product development tells me that neither diesel nor V8 engine will ever show up in a Tundra again. And I know that this is concerning and frustrating for many of you who wants to see good old fashioned V8 engine come back to Tundra and also see the potential for either a diesel standalone powertrain or diesel in conjunction with a hybrid. But none of those things make sense for North American market because Toyota is focused on creating a future that is closer and closer to its vision from its strategy. So if you actually go to the Toyota corporate global website, which is based in Japan, and or talk to other executives, uh, you will quickly find out that Toyota is really focused on creating carbon neutral society, or basically a product that do not emit any emissions. And so uh, everything to do with the V8 engine and the diesel engines goes against the grain of its business strategy. So if you investigate Toyota's strategy very carefully and take a look at what they're trying to do for the next two, three, four, five, even 10 years down the road, well, the focus is all EV or electric vehicle, and the focus is all about electrification, whether it's hybrid, plug-in hybrid, or full EV. So all of Toyota's engineering efforts will be focused on making the best electrification technology and to create a carbon neutral product. So how is it possible that Toyota would even fathom bringing V8 engine or diesel engine into the 2022 Tundra? It just doesn't make any sense. Now, just to clarify, Toyota does offer the diesel engine in many of its lineup throughout Asia and other parts of the world, uh, including the new Land Cruiser 300 series. It will have a new turbo diesel engine as well. But uh, that engine, while it could work with the TNGA-F platform, is not currently certified for North American use. Could they certify it for North American uh, product? Of course they can, anything is possible. But if you look carefully at the numbers of diesel products that are sold in US or Canada and look at the volume, uh, historically, it makes no sense because there just isn't the volume to justify its presence. In fact, if you look at Ford, which sells more full-size trucks than anyone else, uh, well, they have decided to cancel their diesel engine in their lineup. So Toyota, which is carefully studying the successful recipe of Ford's full-size truck, is going to look at it and say, well, there's no way we're going to offer diesel if Ford isn't going to offer one. I know Dodge uh, and also a GMC Chevrolet are offering diesel still, uh, but the numbers are pretty small, so it makes no economic sense to either bring diesel or diesel hybrid to North American market for the short term. Again, down the road, who knows what's gonna happen. So I want to dismiss that right off the bat. 
uh, that uh, diesel and V8 will not be in the 2022 Tundra. We're going to have a 3.5 liter twin turbo V6, which by the way displaces 3,444 cc. So it's actually technically speaking a 3.4 liter V6 twin turbo, but that will be the base engine and there will be a hybrid uh, engine to go with it for the higher flagship model, potentially the TRD Pro or the Platinum or Limited. So we're not exactly sure which engine will be offered on which model or which trims yet, but uh, I know that it will be two engine choices. So even though V8 and diesel will not be offered in 2022 Tundra, it's going to have plenty of power and plenty of torque to pull that truck into a fast lane. So you don't need to worry about that so much. Of course, we're going to get to find out very soon, about a month or so left, likely the week of the September 19th, when we will finally be able to see the full Tundra, full specification, and get to the bottom of this. So we're all excited and looking forward to that. Anyhow, for now, I uh, updated my promotional video about 2022 Tundra. So this is the video I've been creating for a while now that is supposed to be like a media reveal or some kind of promotional video about the 2022 Tundra. And obviously it's my creation and so my imagination is built into that video but it is the best I can think of in terms of what uh, a full reveal video might look like if it was released by Toyota. Partly because we're a bit frustrated that Toyota is still holding so much stuff close to their chest. And so I wanted to create uh, sort of a simulated promotional video that you can enjoy because most of the facts in there are of course my ideas based on my research, but it's going to be pretty accurate. So please enjoy the promo video I created with some updates so that we can all look forward to hearing more and more things about the 2022 Toyota Tundra.